very much. Uh, very pleased to be receiving uh, this award. Came as a bit of a surprise, really, but um, yes, very happy uh, to have that honour. Uh, and I think that uh, we are all very aware of the problems uh, that the Murray-Darling Basin has been experiencing in recent times. And I feel like the Murray-Darling Basin is my herpetological backyard as I started out collecting reptiles in the Victorian Mallee and also along the Murray River uh, when I was very young. And as I grew older, I did numerous trips out into Western New South Wales and Southwestern Queensland. So very much feel at home uh, in the Murray-Darling Basin. And I did notice uh, over the years that the general information and promotional material on the herpet fauna of this very important region of Australia is limited. And uh, it suggests that the high number of species uh, contained in the basin is, in my opinion, greatly underappreciated. The only thing I've ever really seen over the years is a couple of posters, one on the frogs and one on the lizards and snakes. So that was some of the uh, motivation to, to do something with this special area. And so hopefully my publication will lead to a much better understanding of the frogs and reptiles in the Murray-Darling Basin and more concerted efforts for their long-term conservation. And again, I'm very pleased to be receiving this award. Nobody ever really writes a book on their own. When you do take on the project of writing a book, um, you've got to expect that it will take over your life until it's finished. And that's how it is. And books, as I say, help with, uh, produced with the help of numerous people. And there are some people I would like to thank. Uh, Nick Kleeman, uh, Rachel Hammond, Jules Farquhar, Eloise Moore Ford, Stephen Marnie, Steve K. Wilson, Marcus Whitby, and my wife Stephanie and sons Daniel and Tim, who have always been there and, and supported me in my herpetological endeavours. So once again, thank you very much. I'm very happy to be receiving this. Thank you very much.